We have an urgent message from Planet Typhon. It comes from Tech Marine Martellus. We thought him lost in the Tyranid War, but he survived. He needs your help, Commander. Tech Marine Martellus, to any Blood Ravens capable of receiving. I am transmitting from the Astronomic Array Station. Martellus, are you receiving? Sergeant Tarkas! Thank the Omnissiah! I am defending the Array, but the Traitor Legions are here! Retribution, prepare to provide close support. Target acknowledged. An Ally's forces are coming under attack. Commander, we are not alone here. No power. The chapter's recruits stand ready. Hostile movement up ahead. Taking heavy fire. Brothers, fire! Away from me, Fiend! Get down! Martellus! We must revive him! That's the target acknowledged. Step on the road to the alive, brothers. This way. At your command. Reposition. Be vigilant. Planting charges. Scouts here, still in acknowledged. Be vigilant. <laughs> Ashes will remain. Scouts here, still engaged. Planting charges. Charges set. 
As you order. At your repositioning. Moving into the ruins. I have located our battle brothers. Squad repositioning. The cleansing begins. My thanks, Commander. I'm glad to see you again. We had thought you lost when your Thunderhawk went down, Martellus. How did you survive? A story for another time, Tarkas. The heretics will surely try for the array again any moment. We cannot stay here defending this relic for all eternity, Tech Marine. Agreed, but we cannot leave the valuable data in its cogitator for the enemy to take. Strike Cruiser, this is Tech Marine Martellus. Deploy power generators in the following coordinates. Tarkas here, Cyrus here, under fire. belongs to the Orcs! Greenskin looters. A fight on two fronts, then. Commander, the Orcs are using a gate to access the complex. We should seal it. The green skins will just go around, Cyrus. Exactly. Directly into the traitor space marines. Under suppression fire. fire. 
reflects from the wreckage of my Thunderhawk. They are in a storage area a short distance away. If possible, we should recover these items before they are looted by the orcs. Move into that position. Hope is the first step on the road to disappoint Optical Squad. Return fire. Tarkas here. Generator Space Marines. Provide cover. Tactical squad. We are suffering by heavy losses. I'll crush your plan. This was night at the time.
Greenskin falls to the might of man! Tyranid Hive was as foul as that scum. Indeed, Avatus. Commander, Cogitina recovery is complete. We can safely leave this place. Now you can tell us the story of your survival, Martellus. Let our enemies beware, for victory is ours.
Thank you for your timely intervention, Commander. I will initiate the repair rights for the items you have recovered. In particular, I shall restore our Terminator armor. Eliphas has yet to show himself again. He must be planning something. That heretic is too dangerous by half. I thought he died during the Cronus campaign. As did I. I saw him torn to ribbons. How does he yet live? Souls are both playthings and currency in the warp. Eliphas may have died in the flesh, only to have his soul bartered among demons. It seems they restored his body when it suited them. More likely his death was a deception, a mask for his escape from Cronus. There was no deception. In either case, it speaks of Eliphas's power. Tarkas is correct to worry. Just how did you survive, Martellus? Yes, a good question. As you may recall, I was aboard a Thunderhawk during the climactic battle with the Tyranids. I also recall it being blown from the sky. A Thunderhawk is a resilient craft. Instead of destroying us outright, the Tyranid attack sent us into a desperate dive into the jungle. My brother Pilot used all his experience to guide us into the highlands, where the infestation was less severe. He did not survive the crash landing. I was left alone. No transmitters survived, and my own cybernetic enhancements were severely damaged. It took me months to successfully enact the repair rights to regain my mobility. I spent the rest of the past year battling my way through to the astronomical ray. Your perseverance does the chapter proud, Martellus. Perhaps. But I am glad to be in the confines of a mighty strike cruiser once more. <laughs>